Hey, what's going on guys? It is Jaco here and today as you see I'm finally in a face cam my wisdom teeth swollen finally went down and uh uh, yeah, let's stop talking about that and let's get right into what the video actually is and it's the borderlands 2 How to mod with the save editor and add whatever you want add whatever level you want to any player If you already know what a save editor is then it's pretty self-explanatory You can pretty much mod any player at any time with anything you want and it's really simple to use I'm gonna be showing you guys how to download it and uh, real quick how to use it on uh, one player um, I am using a siren as an example. So yeah, let's get started. All right So the first thing you want to do is head to this web page right here um, It's not it says it's not secure, but don't worry I'll put the link in the description so it can just take you right here to Rick's game stuff I'm not really sure what that means. This guy works really hard. You save editors. He has a pre-sql one right here Make sure you do not click on that one and you want to click on the borderlands 2 save editor right here and then you can download the latest release from github it's going to take you to this page and then usually he'll say which one to download and it is this one right here the third one so yeah make sure you download that and then after you download that you'll um get this file and then all you want to do from there is uh open up the gibbed borderlands to save edit of course i've already downloaded it so we can just open it right up all right so now the save editor is here and it's pretty um um, cool you can add stuff to your character vehicles you can add money currencies uh, whichever one is in the game you can add all the fast travel so you don't have to actually do any missions to get to place to place to place uh, you know you can add items of course and weapons and you can add stuff to your bank and yeah it's uh, really simple so to get started all you need to do is click open and it'll automatically show up with uh, some of your saves from your um, Borderlands 2, whether you have it on Steam or if you have it um, on some other uh, device or thing, whatever. So it's going to be this first one right here. This is an old one that I had through USB, so don't worry about that one. It's usually going to be the first and only folder here, so you just want to click on it. This, I know for sure, is my Gunzerker, so I'm not going to click on that one. I'm going to click on the second one just so I could show you an example of uh, level 1 Maya. As you guys can see, it is my level 1 Maya. It is at level 1. So, yeah. And then you can just mess with this. You can make it 80 um, experience points. Um, I don't even know how much experience you need to hit level 80. So, I'm going to make it a bunch of 9s over power level, 10, of course. You want your general skill points i just make it 999 999 name you can change also the skin if you don't have any skins i'll just make it the minecraft skin i just saw it where to go there it is minecraft as well i'll find the minecraft head right here somewhere i don't know which one it is oh man all right well we'll just do the clean shave even though it's really ugly and then from there you can uh switch skins on your vehicles if you want you can give yourself max money here i'll, I'll just give myself 99999 just real quick just uh as an example 500 iridium um 999 serif crystals 999 torque tokens and you can just add check all to the um Fast travel right here at the very bottom right here. That's the easiest way to do it. And this is probably one of the most confusing parts uh, so far. So to add a new weapon, you can add any attachments on it, any legendary, anything in the game. Um, to do base game, you just click on the first one, and you gotta pretty much go through every little bit about the gun, um, so it like makes sense. So if I want to make, let's see, a Vlad off assault rifle, sure. Um, you got to go to a balance and it'll also show you legendaries It'll go from uncommon rare very rare and then it'll start with the unique and also the legendary ones You see the shredder fire right here All right, so we're gonna be making a vlad off assault rifle of some sort Um, this is kind of confusing right here. I wasn't really good at it at first But uh, yeah, so we can just make a purple random vlad off assault rifle off rip and you, of course, you can change the manufacturers to Vladoff, make it level 80. I just did that real quick. Uh, make it Vladoff, um, whichever your favorite grip is. But I'm just going to make everything Vladoff just for, well, I want the Vladoff minigun for my barrel, definitely. I'm just going to make everything Vladoff just in, um, for the video. Uh, of course, you can change all the elements. It's another pretty cool thing. I'll make it fire for now. Um, accessory one, you can, uh, let's see. Um, I want bullet speed, 
um none for accessory two yeah and of course you can go way more in depth and you uh, add legendaries if you want but um right now i'm just not doing that uh game stage maybe this is how you change the level of it is game change stage i'm not exactly sure it's kind of confusing but yeah we should have uh, the unknown weapon it should be a purple um vladoff launcher that we have why did this go down to 80 i don't even know all right quick slot i'll just make it up and then make it standard all right so yeah that's pretty much how you add a gun um right there and you can also do the same through item it's pretty much the same way um item filter class mods shields let's just make a quick legendary cat class mod or legendary siren class mod um i think they're farther down the legendary ones let's see here legendary siren bam and that's all you need to do for legendaries is just add the very top one because it's like kind of like uh unique i think you can maybe change some uh, i'm not even gonna worry about that because it's uh, honestly kind of confusing uh so yeah um i'm just gonna make it equipped for now it should be um equipped right over there and then to the bank i'm not gonna add that because it's pretty much the same thing is over here at the backpack and yeah it's pretty simple all right and yeah and this is the bout um really nothing else um of course you got to save it go back to number save two and then you want to click yes to replace it and um yeah i think that's about it all right so after you save it then you can just go ahead and exit out of this head to your steam or where you have borderlands 2 and just start playing it and we're gonna go hop into my level brand new level 80 siren so yeah let's do it all right so now i'm on borderlands 2 i'm about to load up hopefully my maya will be the first uh thing i see i think it will be all right so yeah here we are uh, as you guys can see the minecraft skin is on um i'm level 80 so let's just continue real quick yep and like i said i just made this like level one really fast um it's probably gonna make me go through cutscene again isn't it oh yep it is but as you guys can see i think that is the yeah that is the vladoff purple vladoff assault rifle that i made myself so yeah i'm glad it's there oh come on claptrap really man if claptrap only knew how much firepower he's at the end of right now <laughs> he has never seen anything like this before you know i should i should literally have nothing on me right now Look at that go bitch Oh, yeah. Let's get you inside. Alright, so if I'm correct, I should be able to head on into my inventory and see that everything is here. Um, I think I forgot to save the, sh uh, the class mod that I made, but that's okay because I got what is really important here, and that is like op10 everything i didn't even know these default weapons could go op10 that's actually pretty sick but yeah this is pretty much all i need i uh, i'll be fine for like my first couple playthroughs but yeah it's pretty much that simple guys and if you do have any questions be sure to drop a comment down below i'm uh, always down to help um this has been really fun and uh yeah if you guys enjoy be sure be sure to drop a like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one